Hey everyone, James Reeves, TFB TV. Over here at the Grand Power Booth, we're looking at the Strybog. You guys, a lot of you, huge fans of the Strybog. Very affordable pistol caliber carbines. 10 mils just dropped, 45s on the way. We're here at IWA 2024 talking about those today. If you want to see more from IWA 2024, make sure you subscribe to TFB TV Showtime. It's TFB TV's sister channel. Enough about that shit. Let's talk about the gun. What do we have? Hey James, so what we have is a Strybog just in 10 millimeter, which is, I know, you, your, your favorite caliber, so... Mm -hmm. I love it. Uh, yeah, it's a Strybog, takes HK UMP mags. Uh, That's clever, I love it. Yeah, it, it fits actual UMP mags if you can buy them, you know, mm -hmm. they're like 150 bucks. So we make these uh, more affordable for like 20 bucks. Uh, Will that take... 45 and 10 millimeter, or they, do you have particular ones for each? So there is a 10 millimeter and a 45 UMP mag. Yeah, they're, de they're they separate. Are, they, yeah. are, they are different. Now, before we talk about this particular model, let's say I don't know what a Strybog is. Will you explain that to the audience, like what generally a Grand Power Strybog is? Sure. So a, a Grand Power Strybog is a PCC. Uh, but it's different than most others on the market in that it's it's roller delayed, so it's not a direct blowback. Therefore, you get a much smoother shooting gun, and uh, well, you don't get muzzle rise. That's 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 what it does, right? Right. It, it, it shoots with less felt recoil than a regular straight blowback action. For sure, for sure, because like regular straight blowbacks can be more violent than an, an AR, you know, in, in five five six. Right. In when they're nine mil. When they're nine mil. Yeah. But absolutely. See, this takes out. All that, all that unpleasantness out of it. So, talk to really me about easy. this one specifically. So, roll it late. Uh, it's an eight-inch barrel. Uh, it's a slightly bigger upper and lower receiver than the nine mil. Uh, the upper receiver is all aluminum. Uh, you get ambidextrous controls. So, on the uh, on the uh, on the safety on the. On the mag release, you get a... And see, I love that. It's got a paddle. You've got buttons on both sides for the mag release, sides, but the paddle really is dope. Or you have a paddle like on an AK, yeah. so, yeah, you know. Cool. Uh, like I said, it takes UMP mags. Uh, the charging handle is non-reciprocating. Right, so it won't move. So, yeah. so you can see clamp it. Uh, you have built-in backup iron sights. There's a there's a front sight post in a... In a in a groove there. that, yeah, that yeah. runs on, on, in the pick rail, and then you have a rear sight right here, so it's always there. Uh, it fits the same accessories as the 9mm guns, uh, as the 9mm stripe bogs. Uh, Talk to me about that stock, it's pretty nifty. So, this is brand new for the European market. I know it's been on the US market for, for years now, but we finally have a, an adjustable and a folding stock, so that's brand new for, for Europe. For this year and i think it just makes it look really sick i mean oh no no I mean, it caught my eye that's what stopped us i said hold on you know i wasn't sure if i'd seen this combo before yeah because like the the stocks we had before were practical but if a bit you know spartan talk that, to me about eastern european aesthetic oh, yeah, you yeah, know yeah. which like i think functional cool. but yeah. but it can always look better right yeah so, yeah 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 sure so, so rule number one always look cool talk to me about the trigger the trigger on this is, uh, so this is a standard Strybok trigger. It will fit standard, you know, AR triggers, uh, as well as uh, cassette style triggers. So like, you know, a Timney will fit. I can just drop an AR trigger in there. Of your choice, yes. No shit. Yeah, because okay. we all have a different preference, right? So, yeah, yeah, sure, sure. We yeah. all like it. I mean, some of us are boob guys, some of us are butt guys, you know what I mean? So uh, finally, talk to me about the most important thing pricing and availability, if you know, for the U.S.? Yeah, for pricing, I'm not sure on the U.S. pricing, so go to globalordinance.com. Uh, that's your best, that's our distributor in the U.S., so so that's your best place to find uh, pricing. And uh, you said the 10 mils totally sold out, and the 45s, they're on the way. Yeah, and the 10 mils, more 10 mils are, are, on are way coming as well. too. Yeah, yeah. But yeah, 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 the first batch of 10 mils was gone. Yeah, before they hit the shelves, yeah. Okay, well... I mean, look, I, I don't know what the pricing is on these, but I know that you guys always keep them affordable, and that's why you do so well. So thank you, as usual, for your time. Pleasure, James. Guys, thanks for watching. Stay tuned. We're bringing you more from IWA 2024.